Yo, what's up everyone? How are we all doing? Uh, back with another, well, a second Star Wars video. Um, now, obviously I'm aware the game came out a few months ago. I, I bought it when it came out. But I've, I've just never watched this. So, uh, I figured it'd be a cool reaction. Uh, I imagine it was released before the game came out, just to, you know, build some hype around it. Um, it's funny though, because this game kind of split Star Wars, the Star Wars community, like, 50-50. Like, I originally was one of the people that argued that this was just essentially one of the space battles from Battlefront 2. And then you had the whole other set of people saying, no, 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 it's a completely new game. You know, this is this is going to be an authentic Star Wars pilot experience. And it kind of ended up, well, in my opinion, just being somewhere between them both. Um, you know, I, I like the game. Don't get me wrong, it was a cool game. Well, nothing special, but then again, that's why it was only 30 quid or... $50, whatever it was, to you guys. But anyway, let's get in and check it out. You know what's funny? Sorry, I, I've just remembered. Do you remember like when you originally loaded up Star Wars Squadrons, right? And you you selected your character. Did you notice how everyone just looked a little bit Japanese? Like literally everyone, even the even the white and black people just looked a little bit Japanese. I thought it was really weird. Maybe it was just me. I don't know. Pull off the attack. Squadrons disengage. <laughs> It's still always weird for me to see. I know Star Wars has kind of moved into this time period now where everything they release, the, the Empire's are on the back foot. Do you know what I mean? Everything from the most recent Mandalorian episode and all the way, well, through the Mandalorian. Uh, everything in Battlefront 2 to now. I don't know, man. It just felt like for so much of my, start, my, my childhood, it was always the Rebels on the back foot. But now in this new like era of Star Wars, it's kind of like phasing out the Empire, I guess. It's kind of sad, man. I don't know. Not saying the Empire were good, but I don't know. It kind of it's just childhood, really, isn't it? All stations, light speed on my mark. He kind of sounded like a uh, Sam Witwer, voice of uh, obviously Maul out the Clone Wars and Star Killer. That's it. On your way. It does sound like it, don't it? You got to admit. Only two, no more, no less. Don't know. Oh, it gives me chill. Sam Witwer does.
How fucking cool would it be to be a fighter? Like, it'd be cool to be a fighter pilot today, but imagine being a pilot, you know, in the Star Wars universe. Jesus Christ. Is it just me that wants the Empire, the Imperial, to win? That's something you never really think about, and it the debris landed in the planets. So I know we've seen it a few different times in uh, in Star Wars before, a lot in the Clone Wars. You even see it in Revenge of the Sith near the start. But uh, that always makes for such a good shot. Trust, trust, <laughs> trust the rebel pilot to be from Texas, do you know what I mean? <laughs> War's over, Amp. <laughs> Love to see it. Oh wow. Mate, if I hadn't already bought the game, tell me that trailer wouldn't make you go buy it. What a shot that was, man. Just that f that few seconds, wait there. That. Oh, that was a fucking, that was a, I don't know how I haven't seen that. You think they would have played that at maybe like the start of the game and you loaded it up or something, but <laughs> maybe I just skipped it, I don't know, man, but. Fuck, what a, what a clip. That was sick. Um. I'm gonna start making. I'm gonna start bringing you know Star Wars into the channel a little bit more. You know, I'm not really replacing anything else, but kind of just doing even more videos. So definitely put some Star Wars stuff that you want to see in the comments, man. Um, I, you know, I was trying to think. I was thinking of maybe starting a series or something where I rewatch the Clone Wars or rewatch some Star Wars films and kind of just chill with you guys and watch them. Uh, you know, figure out a way to do that. But definitely put more Star Wars stuff in, man, because you know I'm a, I'm a little fanboy, so whatever's good with me. But, uh, you, you know, man, I hit 5k today, so thank you everyone for that. Um, if you wouldn't mind dropping a like, comment, and subscribe, it'd mean the most. If not, don't worry. Um, but peace out, man. Appreciate it. Keep dropping them. See you soon.